What is up my little Lizzies? Today we are starting a new let's play of the game Prey. Now usually I'm not first person game player, I far prefer third person games, but since we're playing We Happy Few throughout October, I've kind of gotten used to it, I'm kind of okay. My combat's still terrible, but we're not gonna think about that right now. And I figured that, you know what? Let's challenge ourselves a little bit. Let's see what other first person player games we can do this month, especially ones on the more creepy and spooky side. And the first one that came to mind was Prey. So I believe we are an astronaut and there is some weird shit going on in our universe. So we're gonna just jump right in, uh, get some settings sorted out. And yeah, I, I guess we are the prey. I assume that's kind of the point, like we're gonna be hunted or something. Um, I presume it might take some homage to like alien, you know, or predator. But you know, I, I do love space. I love it as a genre. I love it as a setting. I don't think I'm gonna love being terrified, but hey, it's spooky season. You might as well do some spooky stuff. So yeah. Okay. All right, notice there's also a new game plus option. I imagine once you beat the game, you can go back and do some cool stuff maybe, but difficulty. Use your wits, weapons, and abilities to survive. Your wits are the only thing that will keep you alive. Nightmare, nothing can save you. Why would that even be an option? Uh, uncover the secrets of Talos 1. Survival is all but guaranteed easy survival won't be a problem for you <laughs> probably <laughs> normal let's go with normal okay this is a set of optional modifiers to make the game more challenging warning these options cannot be changed beyond the screen not recommended for inexperienced players well we don't know how bad it's gonna be so you know let's oh hello oh my god you see his eye was red for a second Oh, okay, male or female? Um, I mean, I don't have a preference. Oh my, look at, oh, it's both their eye. Oh my God. I wonder how different the voice acting is gonna be if we go with male versus female. I, as someone who played cyberpunk, a lot of people definitely agreed that the female voice acting was way more expressive than like standard male V. Um, but you know what, either way, we'll, we'll go with female character you wake up in your apartment in the year 2032 oh my god the fact that that's literally not that far off is actually frightening that's the real scary thing about this game good morning morgan today is monday march 15th 2032 oh my god this game is going to be insane to play in 2032. Hey, Morgan. Wake up. You're burning daylight. You sent the helicopter to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Don't forget to wear your suit. See you soon. Oh, listen, I, uh, really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan. Like old times. Hmm, okay. Well, a couple things. I like how those shoes, those are real, like, branded shoes. Oh, the controller vibrates when I jump. Those are, like, a real, actual brand of shoes. So that's kind of cool. Um, I need the movement to sway a little less because I will get sick. So, give me a second. We interrupt this program for an important news announcement. If you enjoy lo-fi let's plays to relax to, subscribe now and never miss a video. There's a new episode every day, so subscribe to get notified for new content. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video and leave a comment below. Thanks for watching. Now back to the episode. So, what have we got going on here? I can drop something and I can throw it quite callously to be honest. 
Hands-On Electronics, excerpt from the preface to Hands-On Electronics by Antoinette Skoll. By working through a series of practical experiments, this humble manual will introduce you to the fundamentals of modern analog and digital electronics. By the end, you will be able to construct any simple circuit. As Thomas Edison once said, to invent, you need a good imagination and a pile of junk. That's pretty good words to live by. F paradox. Okay. Congrats and welcome. Hello, Morgan. So glad to hear you'll be coming aboard soon. Your first official workday is March, Monday, March 15th. But we first have a series of training exercises we run with all new employees. Just some stuff to clear your life in orbit. Exciting times ahead. Have a good flight and we'll see you soon. Thomas Tucker. And he copied in like my family member because we both have the last name. So I don't know what connection I have. It was, it was definitely their company. Oh, cool. You can, like, do that. Nice. Uh. Oh, that's actually quite helpful. That they let you, like, just focus on the screen. Delivery. Hey, send a package with everything you'll need for your first day. Uniform, transcribe, and a neuromod. Install the neuromod right away, as we'll be running some tests first thing in the morning. Just follow the instructions. I'll be in touch. He, sorry, you gave me all my stuff to be ready a day before, or, like, the night before? That doesn't seem very helpful. Hey, I just got off the phone with mom and dad. They won't be there when the shuttle departs. They're in New York. Company stuff. But they send their best. I think mom's a little disturbed that both her children are going to be outside her gravitational pull at the same time. She said you'd better behave and do everything your big brother says. Okay, actually, she said the opposite. I'm supposed to behave and do what you tell me to. So there you go. That's mom. Anyway, everyone's excited about your ideas up there, so get ready. I'll probably call you in the morning and make sure you're up. See you very soon, Morgan. Alex. Okay, so Alex is our sibling. Alright. Neuromod application instructions. Warning, Neuromod should only be administered by certified Transtar technicians under controlled conditions. Subject may experience slight discomfort, swelling, or redness of the eye shortly afterward. Why? What's, what's gonna happen to my eye? Remove Neuromod from vacuum sealed container. Press rubberized eye cup firmly against bony orbit of eye socket. Keep eye open. Depress orange release trigger and continue to hold Neuromod against eye for five minutes. Dispose of used Neuromod in provided biohazard bag. Sorry, you... You are injecting something into my eye. Why would I let that happen? Like, I, I, I hear that it's the year 2032, you know, and maybe we've come a long way. But considering it's the year 2024 right now, I don't trust anybody putting something in my eye. Congrats. Oh, he gave us some wine. I don't think I should drink that just from what I know about uh, drinking alcohol in games. Is that you get, you get a bit loopy. And I don't exactly know. That's a very big is that a rice cooker that's a huge rice cooker um what's in the cabinet some postcards wait what carry oh if i wanted to like carry the entire refrigerator no i'm good but i guess nice to know that that's an option how strong do I get where I can take a fridge? Also, she has her purse just there. Hmm. Is there a mirror? There is, but I cannot see. Okay. Well, apparently there's a helicopter waiting for me. My door is jammed. Why is the door to my own presumably penthouse apartment suite? jammed conveniently huh and when was the last someone cleaned these windows because they're quite dirty all right how far can i throw stuff oh it disappeared that's kind of my fault okay uh okay so there's a ton of do these stop? 
the nature of consciousness remains deeply deeply mysterious how can the subjective nature of experience my inner life be explained in scientific terms does consciousness emerge from complex computations among brain neurons or is it a fundamental and irreducible property woven into the fabric of the universe see my thing is that these books like stay highlighted and i don't then i don't know like what i've read and what i haven't read okay well i have a controller so at least that's cool all right i assume i can go out of here okay person there that's cute okay do i have shoes on i hope so morning miss you hello good morning how are you doing heard there's a chopper on the roof must be for you you'll have to take the elevator I mean, I'm not the only wealthy person in here, right? Clearly by the fact that, you know, press A to jump, sprint. Okay. I feel like, there we go. I was like, I feel very short. Like, what's wrong? I was still crouched. When you slide, when you run and slide, you stay in crouched position. Okay. Let's get to the chopper, I guess. Ms. Yu, please make yourself comfortable and we'll be on our way. Transstar facility is just a short hop. Thank you. 78 Tyler. degrees. Clear skies all the way. That's cool because to put their credits in this little journey. I wonder what's actually like to fly in a helicopter like this for work. That's insane. That's a nice view on the bay there. Are we in San Francisco? Is that like the the vibe? I don't think there are, I mean, are there any like mountains on the west coast of it? Like hills that are close enough to civilization? Or did they build close enough to like the wild areas? They probably had to. Oh, this is a very spacious helicopter. Oh, the tidal movies on the top of the building. That's not ominous at all. I'm sure we'll be fine and nothing will be prey. Here we are, Ms. Yu. Mind the glass on the way out. Good luck to you. Thanks, man. I feel like we should say thank you. Hello, Dr. Yu. I'm a Sybil 495 science class operator. Calibrating. The last frontier is the human mind, and we are its pioneers. Hmm. Interesting. Welcome, Morgan Yu. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing facility. Please confirm. Uh, yeah, sure. This elevator is flying! Oh my god! This cannot be safe. Morgan! Finally! Hello? Do we say hi to our brother? Can we talk to this dude first who's just eyeing me? Both of y'all are just watching me. Hey! You don't look terrible in a Transtar uniform. Thank you. How's your eye? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but it's a you family tradition. Breaking convention is in our blood. Once you start the test, just do whatever comes natural. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy's gonna walk you through the process. You're in good hands. We'll be in orbit next week. I promise. Mr. Yu, they're ready for your sister in room A. Right. Listen, just be yourself. I'll see you after. 
This sounds so ominous. Dr. Yu. Hello. Is there anything else you want to say to me? I wish I could show you what I've been working on. And why can't you? Also, why is this door <clears throat> filthy? What? Sorry. Hang on. No, 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 no. What is all this? What is all? Like, it looks black, but also red. Like, it looks like blood. It looks like dried <clears throat> blood. Why is there dried blood all up against the security secretary area? Oh, and it's like all up against the door. If you'll make your way into room A. No, I You don't. better get in there before Bellamy gets impatient. And it's all, oh my God, it's all over here. Has there been, wait, is there dry blood all over this place? <clears throat> it's here as well. Where are we? I don't think we're safe. Is this really our brother? Because if you are about to kill me, that's very messed up of you. Um, damn it. Now I'm just uncomfortable because I'm like, wait, is this just a murder mystery? I don't. I don't like the fact that they've just clearly killed somebody. What if I told you I could turn you into a mathematician on the level of Einstein in under 10 minutes? I'd say you're full of it. That's the first thought that crosses my mind. But it withers in the face of Alex Hughes conviction. Despite myself, I riveted. He's not bullshitting at me. Himself, maybe. Me? No. Alex leans back in his chair. Welcome to the age of the neuromod. Okay, so by stabbing something in your eye, you can like learn anything. It's like the matrix. Okay. But what about the people you've like? Good morning, Morgan. Hello. I'm Dr. Bellamy. Hi, Looks I like see we have some tests to run through today. Dried Probably not substances. the kind of thing you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. I don't like this. And who was back there? Great. Let's begin. For this first test, I'd like you to Look remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. Just go with your gut. Okay? Wonderful. Press the red button when you're ready. Okay. Alright, let me... Wonderful. That's... You're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B, then. I assume that red thing means I did badly? Okay. Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. How? It's Take glass. Time, relax. Think it over. Can I squeeze no, in I'm here? Kidding. You only have nine seconds. Well, there's nowhere the to hide. When you're ready to start. There is nowhere to hide. So I this y'all are just setting me up for failure, I feel like. <coughs> y'all are just setting me up for failure. Is she? She's hiding behind the chair. I mean, I'm not. Hmm, not. Why Any there's nowhere to hide. Synaptic register. Would that even be an option? Oh. No? No, that's fine. Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. Head into room C. You're doing marvelous. This feels like a saw test. These people are definitely going to murder me. And I don't like the fact that every single like piece of glass we've seen, there's dried blood. Now I'm curious if someone like murdered someone in my apartment. And that's why. Hello. All right. Here we go. For this test, please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can in the most natural intuitive way possible without thinking just just go for it press the red button when you're ready i mean you say oh intuitive i assume they expect me to have like superpowers did i not put the neuromod in i'm sorry can someone please explain to me what's happening simon i don't I installed exactly what tina brought down did you double check? Speaker still on. Yes, hi. I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. Well, y'all stay over there. You're doing fabulous, actually. One last room. Let's step into D. Something may right, and I don't know what it is. This is giving very much portal vibes. Are y'all just going to make me solve puzzles until I die? Because that's not what I want to do right now. Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. 
Okay, like they Morgan, drag. Have There's a seat more at the streaks. table for me, please. There's more like streaks on the floor by Wonderful them. job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm okay. going to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Press start on the screen when you're ready. Is it going to be timed though? You're planning a vacation. Go somewhere familiar you know you love or try Whenever something you're ready, new. Morgan. Oh, what the hell is that? Sorry, what are those constant noises? Have I lost my mind? Good. Looks like you've got the hang of it. Keep going. You've been sentenced to death for your actions. How does this make you feel? Afraid. I don't know what will happen. Angry. No one has that right. Calm. It was worth it. I don't think I'd feel angry, afraid, or like, I don't mind being calm. I feel like if I do something that warranted the death penalty... I clearly decided that that was the the active decision that was best. Um, so, you know, I, I rarely regret my choices. Ooh, that's heavy stuff. A runway train is bearing down on five people who are tied to the track. You can cause the train to switch tracks, but there is one person tried to decide on tracks. I do nothing only in the sense of I don't I, I have problem, to then right? have to deal with the headache of people being like you killed one person. A runaway train is bearing down on five people. You're standing on the platform next to an enormously fat man, pushing him into the track would stop the train. Again, do nothing in the sense of, like, I would be known as someone who killed someone deliberately. The people who hurt those other people needs to be Almost prosecuted. Done. The runaway train is bearing down on five people tied to the track. You could stop the train by jumping onto the track, but you would die. Jump onto the tracks, push the fat... <laughs> Why is push the fat man there again? Do nothing. See, I don't mind sacrificing myself for the greater good. So that's fine. Wow. I'm impressed. Well done. Well done. We're nearly through it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want okay. you to take a good look at it. Oh. Oh. In a moment, I'm going to ask you what... Uh, what happened? My coffee. It's empty. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. Uh, hi. Hello. Um, what did it do? Where am I dead? Oh my god. Should I have done something? Alex. Simmons. What's going on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? She's alive, sedated. Clean it up. I'm on my way. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th, 2032. Wait. These bastards. How long have they been groundhog digging me? Gr gr what? What did I just say? Groundhog digging me. How long? What's going on? How long have they been groundhog daying me? And what on earth were those ink blobs from that one Mickey Mouse Wii game? And the music is totally different now. Okay. And it, it transformed into stuff. So, okay. I just wanna... Okay. I need I need a weapon. I would like a weapon, please. Um, okay, so are you able to just like continue the Did they fill everything back perfectly? They do! Oh my god, that's so creepy that they like literally do your house exactly as intended. What is my objective right now? I have no objectives, apparently. Uh, okay. Interesting. Circuit board. Speech synthesis. 
wait speech synthesis are they saying that like potentially when i've been on calls with like my brother it hasn't actually been him but we saw him just now in person though okay i've got six emails instead of three They all say, danger, leave now. E, something, what does EOM stand for? End of message, danger, leave now. Okay, from someone called January. Okay, uh, well, I would love to leave now. What was that? I need I need a weapon. I need a weapon. I don't know what I have that's weapon shaped, but we need something because clearly I keep hearing stuff. Can I not take the cup? No, no, no. I need... Can I take the bottle? Yes, okay. I need this. What on earth is that? Is that just like a plane noise? What? I hate that I can't like... Oh. Okay. There appear to be key problems. Um... My entire apartment's gone to shit. Don't know why. There are no lights working. Toggle my flashlight. Okay, will my flashlight die? Wrench, yes. Yes, okay. Swing with RT. Hello, Morgan. It's time we spoke. My code name is January. Okay. You're not dreaming. What happened yesterday was real. Oh yeah? If you want to know what's going on, first you need to get out of your apartment building. You're not safe. Thank you. I got that from the fact that, you know. What does she have? Spare parts? I do like the little... The little flip. Do these lead anywhere? Well, I, they clearly drag someone in here. Okay, where did they drag them from? It looks like it starts here. Maybe? Can I like... I keep hearing something like growl and it's upsetting me. Oh! Why'd the music stop? Hey, 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 the music stopped. Why did the music stop? I'm gonna get the life jump scared out of me. I just know it. Also, why is this closed? This was. This was my hallway. This is how I got to the helicopter. So why? And why is why is she like a sucked skeleton? What's ha what is going on? I have no idea what's happening. I don't even know if I wanna know. Can I get through? Bruh. 
break out. Okay. I want to take this with me. Good. You're in the simulation lab. Now get to the exit. I'll keep in contact. Wait, what? They have a whole sound stage rules. Absolute silence when simulation is in progress. Do not enter stage unless in costume. Do not interact with subject off script. Sound stage A reminders. Always reset the position of stage props in apartment after each test. Replacements for damaged props can be found in the storage area. Be careful not to bump glass when in the observation zones. Wait, have they been watching me while I like sleep and stuff? The helicopter ride looking glass sequence should only be reset in the overlooking control room. Make sure to clear the rooftop of any objects during the simulated flight. Always return the helicopter to its ready position after being serviced. But like, I'm so confused. Why? Why? So our brother does clearly hate us in some capacity. But he definitely doesn't love us because what is what is up with the whole... What's up with the whole, like, I guess, kidnap me, pa like, drug me, and then essentially have me, like, redo my day? For what purpose? Simulation debriefing, observation, and storage. Okay. This is my entire, like, apartment, too. Oh, my God. But then how do they make it look like outside? February 22nd, 2035, midnight to 7.30, sleeping, 7.31, wakes up, 7.32, checks transcribed, 7.34, on computer, various tasks, 8.04, takes shower, 8.26, puts on uniform, exits apartment, 2035, okay, so it's actually been three years. Okay, it's actually been three years they've been doing this. Audio events. Refer to test run program for timing of audio events. Note, pigeon visuals have been disabled due to glitch in render data. Okay. Wait, what do I have? Oh, I have the flashlight and I have that. Okay. So they have wake up calls. Okay. And it calls me directly? Morning. Wake up. You're burning daylight. You sent the helicopter to pick you up. It's so just I knew a few it. tests. So they are Don't using his to like voice. Soon. See you soon. So it's not really him at all. Oh, listen. I, uh, really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan. Like old times. But then I saw him in person, though, so I don't know why they'd, like, lie about that. Hmm. I know this morning's incident has left people shaken. To prevent unnecessary panic, please refrain from contacting people outside of your department. A station-wide announcement will be made shortly. In the meantime, Miss Alazor and her security team are on high alert and will field any questions you have. I know some of you are worried about Dr. Bellamy. He's currently being treated in the trauma center and is in critical but stable condition. Thank you for your patience and dedication to this project. You know, I don't think you can use the word critical and stable in the same sentence. I understand logically you could be an ICU and stable, but uh, that still sounds like a pretty big problem. So, you know. Looking glass simulation labs. Scene editor. Oh my god, it looks literally just like <laughs> software for re video rendering. Okay. And they've basically made sure all the lighting and everything looks how it should. Okay. Uh. What was that? I don't like the sound of that. Can I close the door? What is making that noise? There is something out there making noises.
Marking the entire SKU is defective. Okay, but there's something. Oh. I'm so terrified. What is making that that sound? There's something opening drawers. Password protection. Okay, that's jump. A is jump, B is crouch. Bad install. Simmons, the test results today were all negative. Did you install the correct neuromods, touch base with graves, and figure out what went wrong? This should be your absolute highest priority. Okay, okay, okay. Who has the code to the to the safe? Uh, hmm. Okay. Guess it wouldn't be that easy. I am I am already terrified because are those like actual neuromods? Okay. What is making that noise? See how the noise suddenly stopped? I really don't like that. Wrench. Hephaestus Hefty Twist and Loop Handle Wrench is standard issue for all maintenance personnel employed at Transtar facilities. Good for liberal application of percussive maintenance and mechanical agitation. Use RT to swing your wrench. Press and hold RT to charge your attack. Okay. Why are there two lamps? Oh, is this going to be like the coffee cup situation where I got to figure out which one is which? Because I don't like that. Okay. Why is it upside down? That's just even more terrifying. Okay. Uh... Okay, yeah, so that's just my apartment. All right. Emergency phone, can I please call for help? What is the situation right now? I want my little lamp back so bad. In fact, where's my little lamp? I'm, I'm bringing it, I'm bringing it. Nothing. Okay. I can't run in here, which is interesting. Surely it's not because I'm holding that. Oh my god, I can't run if I'm holding this light? That's gonna be a problem. Okay. This whole place is fake. Oh. I don't want to go in there now, now that you've like. Now that you've conveniently removed the one guy was there and all that dried blood is still there. Oh my god, what is that? something there I'm taking the med kit quick select menu allows you to quickly alternate between weapons and powers assign weapon to power quick select menu then press Y to bring up the menu again okay so 
we'll do Y. We'll assign. Why can I not assign my med kit though? Full. Yeah, that's fine. I want to assign it to stuff. Do I not have a med kit in my possession right now? I'd like to equip it. Because I'm definitely going to need it. Okay. Scene selection. Test management. Reset the test rooms to current configuration. Test rooms affected A, B, and C. I don't know if I want to do that, because is that implying that it'll let whatever the fuck that is out? Like, look, it's glitching and everything. See? That doesn't seem Tiger okay. Jackoplasmus. Everyone calls them mimics. Be careful what you pick up. Okay. And I just I won't pick anything up. Oh! Oh my god! Oh, it broke out! Oh my god, it broke. It broke out. It broke out. It broke out. Oh no 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 no. Will it take Kylie to a chair? Alright, come out. Okay, do I need to fight it though? I mean, it seems very aggro, but this is not like, you know. Should I go in there and fight it? All right, we'll try. Oh, okay, not that bad. Didn't lose any health. All right. Now let's not do that again, though. Alex has requested all orders go through him after Morgan's outburst at the debrief. Pending a psyche valve, Alex indicated he doesn't want any more surprises from Morgan, nor do we, granted. Morgan had forgotten everything from the last test, as expected, but the aggressive response to some of the testing criteria was a clearly a departure. My recommendation is we need to start charting personality di drafts oh my God. drift before future tests in debriefings and within the test itself, Bellamy. I love how I just like, why can't I take paper? Who would want paper? I love how I can just be prepared to like swing. Are you just a chair? Okay. Alex. Simmons, what's going on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? She's alive, sedated. Wait. Clean it up. I'm on my way. Even this issue was pre-recorded? So this happened ages ago, probably. Oh my God. So wait, who's alive then? Who's alive then? Who's here? Is anyone here? Oh my God. This guy's great. Oh. This is going to be a mess. I can already tell. 